Okay, before you start, before you start, really important, get your hook, grip the surface, brush, surface like that, and remember to do the back as well. Always do the back because it's bound to get onto the back. Do that quick and easy. However, what's really important is you do both the same like that. Wet both ones down. So basically what you need to do is any excess water that's on there, take it off, let it dry for a minute. And once that's damp and wet, you won't need to touch it for the rest of the days only when you first start it. If you put too much water on there, as soon as you apply any plaster onto that surface, it will just slip straight off. So, dampen it down, first thing in the morning, and your trowel, before you start, and allow that just to start to dry out a little bit, and you'll start to see it start changing colour, and all the, the gloss is gone, but not completely dry. If you want to, just put a little bit of water in there, spread it around. But get most of the excess water off of it. Let that sit for a couple of minutes. And you're good to go. And then you're ready. Another thing is how to hold the hawk and trail together. Because when you need to reach in to get your material, you need to pick it up, put it on. Okay? Another thing is, you see where the plaster's on there? Do not tap it, breaks off, otherwise all that will go into your work. Keep it nice and clean. Okay, really two simple really tips is holding this and holding these. I'll put this over here for the time being. Let that dry out for a little while. Okay. Cheers.